All right, this is the book of Mark, chapter 13, verse 7, and it reads through all the scriptures. And ye should hear of wars and rumors of wars. Be ye not troubled, for such things must need be, but the end shall not be yet. Mark 13, verse 8, for nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be earthquakes in diverse places, and there shall be famines and troubles. These are the beginning of sorrows. Shall one, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to the Havel by Hashem, the Havel Shab by Hashem, the Kakadash. Shall one to the uh, elders, while I give my Akwaf, I say Shall one, and Shall one to the uh, elders, while I give my Akwaf, like I mentioned before, I say Shall one. And the Heavenly Father's true name is like Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Bahashem, in the name of Masha and Kavasha. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the Lashwan Kadash, the Holy Tongue, and also Shalom. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to bring up. It's a news article from Bloomingbird.com. It's going to be a short, uh, a short news article reading because I got to subscribe to this uh, channel. I mean, I got to subscribe to this news. Uh, website but it's going to be a short read in your way so this is a, a news article for the sit down lesson that I want to bring out from bloomingbird.com published by Manlo Saper Saperio Jr. if I pronounce his name right published by him from bloomingbird.com as of November 24th 2023 at 8 11 p.m. Central Standard Time, and it reads, you know, because especially over there in the uh, especially over there in the uh, territory, the territorial islands over there, not too far from the South China Sea, as we've been seeing the uh, recent, you know, the recent ongoing tensions between the uh, Philippines armies versus the uh, Chinese armies as well, too, over the uh, Navy vessels over there, so I've been increasing tensions of that as of lately from both sides, from the Philippines and from the China Army as well too. So keep that in mind. It says, uh, Philippines and Australia launch a joint patrol amending China's tensions. It says the Philippines and Australia kicked off the first joint maritime patrols on Saturday. Because I think recently, I would say day before yesterday, because I remember I did a lesson on that as well, too, about uh, the United States and Philippines did a joint military exercise. I believe a naval naval exercise drills in the same area, if I'm not mistaken. It says uh, the Philippines and Australia kick off their first joint maritime patrols on Saturday, days after the South Southeast Asia nation conducted a similar activities with the US and the South China. Yep, like I just mentioned. Amending the hiding heightened tensions with Beijing over the contested waters. It says in an indole to enhance bilateral instability and maritime security and domain awareness president uh, of the Philippines said it was a statement posted on X, which is formerly known Twitter. So I'm going to read all the rest of the article right there because i got to sign up for it. So this is the book of Mark chapter 13 verse 7 and it reads again for uh, edification sake of the sit down lesson. You know, the ongoing amending tensions between the uh, Philippines army and the uh, China army over there in the uh, territorial islands not too far from the South China Sea like I mentioned again previously uh, Mark chapter 13 verse 7 and it reads and ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars be ye not trouble for such things must need be but then shall not be yet this is the book of Mark chapter 13 verse 8 read again for edification's sake for nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom and there shall be earthquakes in diverse places, and there shall be famines and troubles. These are the beginning of sorrows. So with that, this was just a little uh, quick news article read of this uh, sit-down lesson of this uh, recent news article from uh, bloomingbird.com. 
as of November the 24th, 2023, at 8.11 p.m. Central Standard Time, published by Men- Menlo Cerro Pelio Jr., was published by him from the Bloomingbird.com, as it reads, Philippines, Australia launch joint patrols amending China's tension, right, amending tensions between China and the Philippines. Now, you have uh, not too long, I would say a day after you had uh, the United States and the Philippines did naval naval drills in the same area. Now, uh, a day later on Saturday, because, you know, the time zones are kind of different over there in the comparisons to the United States. And this was a a day later, another uh, military, I mean, uh, joint patrol uh, drills. This time it was from the... uh, Australia and the Philippines as well too as it says again Philippines Australia launch joint patrols amending China's tension so with that because I, I, I believe if I'm not mistaken it was some type of uh, boat incident between Australia and another nation because you have potential of tensions of that as well too so keep that in mind as well too but other than that So with that, hopefully this uh, sit-down lesson was uh, edifying as well, too. I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekarkadash. Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'akim, Wa'akwaf, and I say Shalom. And the Heavenly Father's true name is uh, Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Ba'ashem, in the name of Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the last one can ask the whole time. And until next time, I will say Shalom.